<laughs> I'm looking around because it's 1016 and the clouds are starting to break up here in Clark County, which is the earliest we've seen this since we got into this morning uh, cloud pattern over the weekend. So it looks likely that all of us will get sunshine by noon. And that means if you live in a spot where it's been 77, 78, 79, you'll probably reach 80 today uh, for the first time back into the mid 80s, I think, uh, down uh, around the Salem, McMinnville area. So it's a nice uh, Monday underway. Hope you're enjoying it. Uh, tomorrow, you know, I really thought, hey, we'll all wake up to clear skies and maybe we will. But the data likes low cloudiness Tuesday morning, but even more brief than what we're seeing today. So really much of tomorrow will be sunny and I'm going to still forecast mid 80s uh, for Portland. And then we start to get a little cooler with some morning clouds on Wednesday, but the more noticeable cool down is set for Thursday with high temperatures only in the mid 70s on Thursday and Friday. Now, you know, I've had the automated seven-day forecast up. I was, I was testing that product. I'm going to put my big blue graphic, the, my actual forecast that I do seven-day. That will go back live tonight. It uh, looks like about 8 o'clock in the evening. And that forecast, if nothing changes, will show us uh, back into an east wind pattern this upcoming weekend with Saturday up into the 80s. And then a big change. Right now, the two forecast models I look at both show us up to 90 degrees or warmer this coming Sunday, Monday, Tuesday. So there might be another little mini heat wave on the horizon. Again, look for a return to my personal seven-day forecast graphic uh, to be up uh, this evening, maybe around eight o'clock or so. And that's all I have to say. We're still looking high and dry well through the 24th, 25th of the month at this point. Um, so I will talk to you soon. Happy Monday.